Michael B. Jordan. What's up, man? B for bloody hell. How are you? How you doing, man? Tell us about your character. Yeah, I mean, I think some of the best, you know, uh, characters, the ones that are, you know, complex and multi-layered. Some of my respect. And bow down. We own ya. We own ya. We only get started now. We He's right in a lot of ways. Him and T'Challa are like, they have this argument, they have this conversation that they're having throughout the entire film, yeah. you know? Um, and I feel like they both make pretty strong points of their argument. You must have surely seen that by now. Oh, yeah. They're so excited. They're yeah. so happy. Boys, girls, all walks of life. You can see all, you know, so many different faces in there and they're just excited, yeah. you know, to go see this project that means so much to them. Like, they, these are the next level of dreamers right here. They're exactly. all, they're, so it's, yeah, it made me smile, man. Lovely. Now, along with the cultural diversity in the film, mm -hmm. it's amazing to see so many incredibly strong women in the film. And you have a fight scene with some of them as well. How was it working alongside them? It was awesome. They were just some of the most badass women I've ever met in my life, man. <laughs> The representation for them is, is so important. The king, you know, is protected by them. They're the fiercest soldiers in Wakanda. I think it sends such a strong message. I mean, they were kicking my butt. There wasn't no real holding back, you know? Love so, cause that. like, yeah, they, they could really hold their own. 